Ashley Cox. And I'm Kane Cheshire. Welcome to this edition of Ram Studio News. Now for your today's announcements. Wrestling is having a meet next Wednesday, November 27th against Cortez and Williamsfield. The meet will be held at Williamsfield at 7. There will be a softball meeting Monday, November 25th in Mr. Inslee's room 186 at 2.30. Ladies, please attend this meeting if you plan on playing. Boys basketball will be having their first home game next Tuesday against Seaton. Freshmen will play at 4, JV at 5.30, and varsity will be at 7. Boys varsity soccer will be having an away game against La Jolla at 4 o'clock. Hey Kane, what exactly is Winter Guard? Winter Guard is an amazing competitive team where you can earn a fine arts credit and a PE credit. It's not only a class, it's an extracurricular activity too. Come and learn how to dance, act, and use equipment. Winter Guard tryouts will be held December 3rd from 6 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. in the 700 building. All guys and girls are welcome. Now here's Esperanza with a story on track. Happy Wars is a I'm Esperanza Miranda, here with Brad Chamberlain. <laughs> Mr. Chamberlain, how are you today? I'm doing very well, thank you. Can I ask you a few questions about track? Of course. Why did you start Track Club? Uh, we started Track Club because we wanted to give the students here at Maricopa High School an uh, opportunity to get in shape. Who can join Track Club? Uh, anyone can join Track Club. You don't have to be on the track team to join it. Um, it's for all kinds of students. We had almost 40 kids there last Thursday. When and where does track, t track Club take place? Track Club takes place uh, every day at 2.45 on the track. Uh, we run first and then we lift after that. And it's uh, all it's five days a week. Thank you for asking Four, my questions, Coach Chamberlain. Back three, to the studio. Two, one. If you guys have any more questions or want more information about track, please visit Mr. Chamberlain in room 122. Thinking about joining the military after high school? Well, the ASVAB will be giving next Tuesday from 7.30 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. Any students thinking about going into the military is required to take this test. If you'd like to sign up for the test or have any questions, please see Mr. Veltree. Be sure to sign up as soon as possible. The November issue of our school newspaper is finally out. Be sure to pick up a copy either in your homeroom or in the front office. Hey gamers, have you ever heard of a game called Happy Wars? Well, lucky for you, we have a review about it, so let's check it out. Happy Wars is a multiplayer online game defined as a role-playing strategy game, although it also has a short story-driven single-player campaign mode. The multiplayer mode consists of two teams of up to 15 players attempting to destroy the other team's castle while also defending their own. The players choose from one of three classes, the warrior, the mage, and the cleric. There are also subclasses, although the only ones implemented at the moment is the warrior-type berserker, as well as the mage-type zephyr and the cleric-type engineer. Happy Wars was the first free-to-play multiplayer online Xbox Live arcade game for the Xbox 360. So far, there are nine different maps, each containing their own special traps and surprises for you to enjoy. Thank you for watching and back to the studio. Wow, that looks like an interesting game. I'll have to go check it out even more. Market Day continues today at lunch. Today it will be held in the cafeteria due to the weather. Be sure to check out all the things they will be selling. Fellow students, do you love Shakespeare? Then come to the showing of Romeo and Juliet. It will be tonight at 7 p.m. and tomorrow at 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. Remember, tickets are 5 bucks. And if you want to see me or fellow star Judith Perez in the show, be sure to stop on by. As you all know, Homecoming was a few weeks ago. I hope everyone enjoyed it. Here's Amelia Trujillo with the story on it. 
This is Millie Trujillo with the Ram Studio News here at the Homecoming Dance. I heard nothing but good about this dance. I can only imagine next dance and how it's going to be and how much fun people are going to have. I feel bad for the people who didn't come because they missed out on a good experience for the 2013 Homecoming Dance. For the people who didn't know who the Homecoming Royalty or Court was, Prince and Princess, it was Angel Moreno and Alexis Carrillo. For Homecoming King and Queen was Patrick Keane and Cheyenne Four, Nielsen. Three. Now back to you One. guys at the studio. Homecoming looked like a lot of fun. Congratulations to all the royalties. Maricopa's first City Hawkins dance will be held December 7th from 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. The theme is Written in the Stars. Ladies, don't forget, it's your turn to ask out the guys. The tickets will be $10 for individuals, and for couples, it'll be 15 Spirit Week is approaching very fast. It will be December 2nd from through the 6th. Monday is extreme weather, Tuesday is Santa's Helper, Wednesday is nice and cozy, Thursday is tacky sweater, and Friday is candy cane day. Don't forget to participate. There will be a pep assembly December 6th. If you're interested in performing the national anthem or have any suggestions for activities, please visit Stuco in room 127 during your lunch. Do you ever think about what is in the things you eat each day? Some of the things that you consume could indeed be poisonous. Here's a video on it. I'll be careful what I eat next time. I'm Ashley Cox. And I'm Kane Cheshire. I hope everyone enjoyed this edition of Ram Studio News. Have a great weekend, Rams.